Hello guys and welcome back to Let's Play Morrowind. Uh, when we last left off, um, we actually had found the cave where this lovely lady is uh, and she's got a scamp in here. Uh, I think we need to speak with her. Actually, speak, traveler. I think we need to get her disposition up. So let's just quickly quick save. Um, I her disposition is a little bit on the low side, right? I don't know if that's going to be high enough. Guild Jews. Will you leave me alone if I give you the 2,000 septims? I cannot leave my research unattended. Yes. Here, take the, take the gold and leave me to my work. I would advise you that you'd leave here now. We are engaged in very serious research here, and if you disturb my colleagues, they may not be very understanding. Okay, and um, we're going to quick save again, actually, because I'm super curious to know what is going on in this cave. Hmm, what do we have in these urns? Come on, fight! Fight? What? We don't know. Whoa! Uh, we don't want to fight. It's just dense around this cauldron. What is she trying to cast there? Is that... Oh dear. Oh, I, uh, health is not very high. And, uh... She seems to be quite strong. Is it a she? It looks like a she. Where are they going? They're running around the wrong direction. Are they trying to run up or run away? Oh my sharp blade is up. A, <laughs> a few quick stabs to the back. If it did anyone any harm. <laughs> whoa. Oh, 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 oh my word. <coughs> when this might be Right, where's Fargoth's ring? We definitely need... Ah. Come on. Ah. Right. That's the end of you. Whew. Exhausting stuff. It's not really got very much on it. Let's have a look. An apprentice stuff, a ball, bone meal, apprentice, apprentice, apprentice. Nothing here is all that exciting. Let's quickly quick save again. Are we are we able no there's enemies nearby? I wanted no, we need to rest, seriously. Fargoth's ring is spent and uh <laughs> we don't really have anything. Oh, ah, wow. Okay, yeah, that's us dead. Um, you know, maybe we'll just uh, make our way back, shall we? Uh, and go see this Telvani mage. So we've done this little little job. Uh, I think it would be interesting, but I do believe that the research. Uh, what happened to you, Outland? that they're involved in here uh, is certainly something to do with uh, man we can't even rest here um, Daedra because I, I do have a recollection of the last game that I played um, uh. oh my word what was that oh, it's two cliff races we are so <laughs> oh my word oh wow we should rest and learn and meditate on what we've learned. I would absolutely love to do that. Um, but why that would that would that take us to level four? Certainly would take us to level four. What can we do? What can we do? Let's have a look at the world. Right, I've got a plan. Um, and it involves using magic. So, what I think we will do, we'll take a portion of Restore Magicka. We will cast 
mark here. Okay, mark has been cast. Then we will use our scroll of uh, divine intervention. And then that will teleport us to the nearest shrine, which I think will be Fort Bookmo. Oh no, apparently it's here. N doesn't really matter. Just need We just need to be taken somewhere where the civilization... That's the armorer. That's Ents... Trader... Me Mebistine Ents. Um, right, and then we're going to need to go upstairs, and we need to sleep in the bed. Come on, I haven't got all day, you know. There's a guard here. Excuse me. Until healed. Oh, <laughs> hello, Mr. Guard. <laughs> all right, so we need definitely on speed. Uh, and we need some points again in intelligence and then again I don't know personality I think we need to work on definitely okay so now we are level 4 everybody yeah I'm really pleased with that uh, it was a bit incidental but that the only real way that you can get to level up is if you actually go out into the wilderness and really really sort of take on the foes that you might come across there I think we need to sort our dagger out Oh, we're probably going to run out of hammers trying to get this back up. That's it. Run out of hammers. Not too bad. So, we've got, we've got some good use out of them hammers. So, um, right. I suppose the next thing we need to do now is to recall. And, I mean, if we were massively inclined towards further finding out what's going on here, we can actually go go and investigate these caves. We might do that, actually, after we've finished trying to find this Telvani. Wow, these cliff races are still here. We went to sleep for 12 hours. And this this still waiting for very persistent creatures. If that is the case. I was stabbing wildly. I can't wait until our... <coughs> until our short blade ability is up to a sufficient level where we can pretty much strike nearly 100% of the time rather than clicking furiously and getting next to nowhere. So, we have to along the left hand side oh not another alley look at those humongous jaws right come on time to succumb ooh alley skin that is what we're looking at on the left hand side it's definitely here we are right sully pond this is what we want to see this is what we were after quick save Oh, I wonder if the skeletons and things in here. All right. A trap door. I don't think you're the person we're after. No. Useless tourists. Not you. I think the main man himself is upstairs, or the main person. You definitely look magish. Find someone else to bother. Yes. So I'm going to save here, guys. XM80. Wow. And uh, when we come back, we're going to try to convince this person to join the Mages Guild and then we're gonna zip our way back home and uh, make the most of 
um, the cash that we've got ourselves and uh, hopefully we'll get some advancement uh, and then we'll check I think I don't know how many days have gone by but we'll see if we enough time's gone past to see if our stronghold anyway uh, so until next time guys stay safe take care of yourselves and goodbye